All right, hello, ladies and gentlemen. Here we're going to go over how to go over this practice problem from unit three, lesson number two, problem number one. So first, let's read the problem here. <clears throat> um, the tortoise and the hare are having a race. After the hare runs 16 miles, the tortoise has only run four miles. Okay, so here, 16 miles, the tortoise has only run four miles. Here we have a rate. Okay. And now we have our paragraph here, the relationship between the distance X, the tortoise runs in miles for every Y, the miles the hare runs is Y equals 4X. So we, we have that equation right there, Y equals 4X. X is the distance that the tortoise runs, and Y is the distance that the <clears throat> hare runs. So let's look at what this equation is saying here. So the hare is taking the number four times the amount that the uh, tortoise runs. So the hare runs four times more. That's why our equation is four times X. So what we can do is do it several ways. One way you can do is if the tortoise runs one mile, then we can make a table, right? Tortoise, hare. If the tortoise runs one mile, the hare will run four miles. If the tortoise does two miles, the hare is going to go eight miles. If the tortoise does three miles, the hare will go 12 miles. So when in doubt, make a table, okay? So here I have one for the tortoise. Notice the axis here, tortoise is the X. Hare is the Y axis. So now I'm going to put my first point, one, four, two for the tortoise, and eight for the hare, three, 12. And then notice how all my points line up. So that, that's how I know that I have my graph done correctly. Another way to look at the equation is to notice this number right here, the four in our equation. This is the unit rate. So when you have it like that, y equals a number times x, the number that's being multiplied is the unit rate. So I know that for one, it's four. This box right here is also the number there for the unit rate, this box here in the table, which is also this point here on the graph. So whatever it is for one, that's the unit rate. And you know zero, zero. And again, you see how all these points line up. So it's a different way. And then you're going to use your use a straight edge to draw the line. And that's the graph. All right. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen.